Hello guys, yes, I told you all we'll be doing kaklo. Yes, kaklo, or what people call krakro or kakro. So any of them, yeah. So guys, let's get right into it. So we are having a overly ripe plantains. Yes, with this recipe or with kaklo, you can only use overripe plantains to do it okay so this is what we are going to use we are going to cut that into nice and small pieces yes yeah, so that we'll be able to grind it we are going to use a sanka and ato as well but if you have a food processor or a small mortar you can go ahead and grind that in there yes so this is the shape we've cut them into we are going to go ahead and grind this guys and then we have our spices i'll be listing the spices in the description box it's actually the same as that of the killy willy yes yeah, so if you've watched our killy willy video it's the same spices we are going to use to do our kaklo over here so guys yes we are going to grind that into a fine paste and then add salt to taste so once we've achieved our desired texture we are going to go ahead and add a little of corn flour yes we are going to use corn flour as a binder if we don't add corn flour and we put it in the oil it's going to split apart we are not going to get a kaklo shape so we are going to go ahead and scoop our corn flour into our grinded plantain yes guys this is roasted corn flour i bought it from the market some time ago you are going to grind or mix everything together if you add a lot of corn flour it means your kaklo or your kakro is going to be very hard like very very hard so add in bit by bit and once you are okay with the thickness you are good to go yes so this is what we've achieved at the end of the grinding and the mixing of the corn flour so guys everything is ready here and we can go ahead and do our frying So we are going to put our fry pan on fire, add some oil, and on a medium heat, see yes, as a medium heat, we don't want our kaklo to get burnt. So we are going to use medium heat to, to do the frying the throughout. Yes. So once the oil is hot, we are going to go ahead and scoop this into the oil make the surface flat or bulky enough so it looks like a cloak yes 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 so we are going to allow it to cook or to fry enough and once it's getting brown you can see your kaklo is getting ready and guys you can take this with abo boy or bambara beans you can take it with gobe or beans and you can take it just like that or with some peanuts guys and it's so nice kaklo is just so nice so no need throwing your overly ripe plantain away guys turn it into a beautiful and a nice and sweet kaklo
so we are going to repeat this process throughout until we are done with the frying and guys this is our kaklo looking so beautiful in fact i had a lot i had a lot because the plantain it's plenty yeah so guys it's a very simple recipe i'll list the spices in the description box once again and this is how kaklo looks very soft moist in the inside okay thanks for watching bye bye